On this morning's Health Watch, 3D mammograms, about 40 million traditional mammograms are performed on American women each year, and they detect 80 to 90 percent of breast cancers. Medical correspondent Dr. Jennifer Ashton is here now with the latest on this new technology that's going to enable doctors to see even more. I mean, I think just to the layman, 3D sounds better than 2D, so is it that much more accurate? That's correct, Chris. And in fact, it is more accurate. Studies have shown that these three-dimensional three mammograms improve a doctor's ability to spot cancer by 7%. The hope also is that it'll reduce the number of women called back because their initial imaging results were unclear or ambiguous. Here's the big question. How much is it going to cost and will insurance cover it? Well, when we spoke to the lead investigator at the Massachusetts General Hospital, where the only place where it's being done right now, she told us that they are not charging additionally for this 3D mammogram now. They're just billing it as a two-dimensional mammogram. In addition, there's the possibility that in the future, this may become the standard and the two-dimensional mammogram that we're using now everywhere will become less expensive. We just don't know yeah. yet. It sounds like breakthrough technology. And like you said, it's only available at Mass General right Correct. now. When can we expect to maybe see this on a more widespread basis at other hospitals? Well, what the company has said is they have hundreds of these machines and the software already out across the country. Those centers need to train their radiologists in how to interpret these images, and they need to pay for the software, so they're hopeful by the end of the year much more widespread. Yeah. Any drawbacks? It's twice the amount of radiation as a regular mammogram, and we have to remember, even though this will be more accurate, hopefully will reduce both false positives and false negatives, it will never replace a tissue biopsy. All right. Dr. Janashin, thank you. You bet, Good Chris. to see you.